Hi, this is another Visual Basic order system developed or ordering system developed. So I'm just entering all the data in, into the text box. So I just need to enter, let's say, enter the address there. Let's say Denton, Denton High Road. Uh, let's go for maybe Dallas, I think, for port, something like that. Think that's the spelling and then let's say okay that's my made up address and a note let's say collected by Mr. Ashley Kings. Alright, so that's it right there. It's, very, it's a very simple ordering system. So here you have a checkbox delivery completed yes customer accept the agreed the agreement yes and right here that is just uh, like a receipt you just need to click on that well that's fine okay all of those information appears for the customer the other thing is the exit button works the discard button works you can always discard if you want the other two buttons are not required and this just need to be changed so if I click on discard and that's it so what I will do next is take you guys straight into the development environment and show you how to put this together so let's exit the system all right right in here let's close that I have a text box might as well show you the name that's the text box right there txt delivery address txt note that's another text box there's a text box in here and all of these components right here are all text box you can see their names and right here as well those are their names and all of these components are all labels okay and I have more or less a parent container here and the parent container is just a, a type control and that's all and there's one more component or two more I have a checkbox another checkbox there then save that's to save the data in here discard that's just to clear the system you can always call it any other name maybe reset or whatever okay and here now let's just change that to reset there that's cool then uh, view details I wouldn't need those and uh, total I might as well change total to view order okay there and that's all there is to this very simple program maybe we should rearrange this here that's all there is to this simple program so the next thing I'll do now is uh, double click on the save and just show you the codes in there that's the codes in there for me to save whatever content and I have inside our very text box known as a TXT receipt print and right here I have reset reset is just to clear all of the components that's it right there those are the lines of code just to clear all of the component then here I have view order i have just changed it to view order so view order have all of those components saved straight into the receipt that's it right there all of your order are then entered into the receipt if you want you can print it out and that will be another tutorial okay if i double click on exit application dot exit that's just the risk to this very tutorial okay it's not that difficult so i'm let me show you guys the codes one more time save clear or reset view the system and that is all to this very program if I run it now let's enter some data in there let's say we'll go for 35 Steve Steve Town Road uh, call that was a what town and uh, here we just let's give it a postcode whatever postcode that's cool there may be their telephone number so you can just enter something there 
That's your phone number. If you have a note here, all the four home delivery. Okay, that's just a note there. Then uh, customer details there. All right, that can be C O. So dispatch due, yes, and that is it. So was it delivered? Yep. Ms agreed. Yep. Save the content. Okay, let's view it first. That's everything. That's all of the information right here. It's right in here. Okay. So we can then save it if we want. See that? Ready for you to be saved onto wherever you want to save it. So I'm just going to call it order number whatever. But let's put Sally. Sally. Bells. So we can open it again. I'll save it on the desktop. There. So supposing I open up my desktop, let me open up my desk right there. And that is Sally's order. Okay. So let's go back into the system. And that is how you develop an ordering system. A very simple one. Easy, very simple. You can develop this under 30 minutes and that'll be all. Okay, I'll just with that I'll call it the end of this program. I suppose you all enjoy it. Thank you.